Hey guys, how's it going? Happy Sunday. And I can say that confidently. You know why? Because there's a whole new approach going on in this world with me and my videos. And oh my God, my lower body is on fire right now. My videos are going to be topic titled and specific. And I'm, very, I'm really just so excited about it. I said that in my last video. But today I just finished. It's Sunday the, hold on never know what date it is. Usually don't know what month it is, unless I look outside. Um, what did I just say? It's the 30th, August 30th. I just, uh, I got up early, went to church, had my time with God, and then um, did some stuff in the kitchen. I don't remember what. Oh my God, my calves. Sorry. I just have this tendency when I shoot my videos to be up on my toes. It's just a thing. I don't know why. I also drive barefoot. You should know that. Ever since I had that Ford Fiesta and I was part of the Ford Fiesta movement and it was a stick shift car, um, I drove barefoot in that all the time because I don't know, it made me feel more comfortable. So whenever anyone gets in the car with me, they're like, do you always drive barefoot? Yes, I do. Um, so here's the thing. I just finished a bar workout. And one of the things that I'm focusing on now, I'll shoot another video about that because we're all about focus and singular topics so that you guys can jump around and get bite-sized portions of Kelly Alexa. Um, so I just did a bar workout and you guys, I kid you not, I actually hadn't done this one. Now I'll put a link below in here and also on my blog. Um, the one I did today was Leah, I hope I say her name correctly, Leah Sirago, um, ballet body, if I'm correct, and it was full body. Now I've done her workout in the past, which was just lower body. And again, if you go to kellyalexa.com, which I do hope you, my YouTubers will go over there to kellyalexa.com, link below and subscribe. I'm blogging regularly again and so much of what I talk about here, there's more over there, plus giveaways and coupons and links to cool stuff on Fitfluential, which of course, you gotta make sure you subscribe there too, fitfluential.com, link below. Um, free workouts, free recipes, awesome recipes. I just pinned some pumpkin ones today. Um, deals, discounts, coupons, and pretty much giveaways about every day. And it's free. What's bad about that? One of the things I'm working on this month and will continue the rest of the year is I dedicated myself to two things. Um, and I'll add more challenges because the challenges are making my workouts fun. I dedicated myself to doing, making every single day a different workout. Um, I think I'm going to be able to do an absolutely different workout meaning the cardio is different, the, if I do a home DVD, it's different, if I do one of Whitney's plans, it's different. Um, you know, every single day will be different. There will be no repeats. In other words, it's like when they do that on the radio and they're like, does anybody listen to the radio anymore? <laughs> no repeat Monday or whatever. So number one was completely making every single day a different workout. Why? Because y'all know I have a tendency to find something I love and do it over and over and over again. And I also, number two, tend to avoid the things I hate. So I hate working triceps, Mr. Flow, Mr. Flow, there you go. I hate working chest, I hate working triceps. I usually don't like most hamstring ex exercises, which is funny because I love both on, you know, when you see somebody, a, a man or a woman with great, um, a, a great physique, I always admire hamstrings, and yet I hate working them, especially on the ball. Um, it just, and I have ridiculously tight hamstrings. So. Those are the two things I'm focusing on, is making sure every workout is different, making sure I do the DVDs that have been, you know, that I purchase and they've been sitting in my closet or my, you know, storage, and I keep going back to the, you know, 10% of DVDs that I love. That's great when you can love something, but let's focus on diversity. I also tend to avoid core, um, because you all know in the, in the past when my hormones really got jacked and I had gained the, you know, the fat was all on my core. To be honest, I realized that mentally I didn't want to do core because I didn't want to look down and see that for the first time in my life, I've always had a really flat belly and I didn't want to see the belly fat. Now, isn't that silly? Sorry, I'm sweaty. But that's why I avoided it. So those are the two themes and I'm covering them on my blog. I hope you'll join my challenge because the month of August has been amazing. And it has, and I'll, I'll show what I did with links to the kinds of workouts. Um, and yeah, I'm starting some challenge groups in September. If you guys want to join me, join in. I'll be your coach. Um, but here's the thing. I'm also going to share with you my impressions, what I love, and why I think 
you know, if you want something new, you should try this workout or that workout or, you know, here's something new that I tried that I loved. This bar workout that I did, first of all, bar workouts in general are not just for women. I have a ton of my Fitful Entral ambassadors that are men that have tried bar workouts and love them. They are more intense than you can possibly imagine. And what I love for me about bar workouts is I like to look at my whole week and balance out some really heavy weight training, like isolation style, like think of a day that's chest and triceps, right? Um, with full body circuit, circuits and then yoga and bar. Because to me, when you're doing either no workout, or excuse me, no weight or minimal weight, and this style, it's working your muscles in ways you don't. Uh, in all of that other training, um, I don't want to say it's giving you a break because you guys, I just was so humbled. It was uh, upper body first, and of course I was looking at upper body bar going, come on! I was weeping with some of these moves she had. Um, it, I mean, my shoulders got a killer workout, and you all know how I love my shoulders. Um, working, you know, training delts and working on my, um, you know, improving that the size and definition of my arms. My arms were on fire. And then she moved into lower body, <laughs> and I was very, very humbled. And sometimes I'm just blown away with bar how these instructors figure out the tiniest little tweak, and they'll explain it on how you twist and how they'll like, you know, think of sitting back in a chair or whatever, and and ti a tiny tweak of where your feet are or how low you're bending or or whatever and you will feel your muscles burning like you've never felt them before. It is so humbling. And then, one of the things I, I told you just a second ago that I hate doing is core. There was 20 minutes of each and 20 minutes of core at the end. And I, again, very humbled. I'm proud of myself that I did it because what I would have done before is go, I don't want to do core. I'll do core later this week. And then I would never do core. So I did core. I can feel that I'm on fire. And now my goal is that the next time I do that, I'll be able to progress further and further in core. She did this one move that I've never done before, and I know I'm going to have doms all over, but especially in my core. So I encourage those of you, I'd love to hear from you in the comments below. Have you tried bar workouts? If not, are you going to? Um, I will be linking to a ton of bar workouts, some of my favorites, um, at my blog, kellyalexa.com. Um, so let me know if you've tried it and uh, if you love it and what are your favorites. And then number two, if you haven't tried it, let me know if you're planning on diving in and, and um, you know, trying something new. Um, and down below, like I said, sorry, I'm a little out of breath and flabbergasted. I'm so, I've just, just got my butt kicked. I thought, oh, it's Sunday. I have a nice little bar workout. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I gotta go. You guys have a great day. Woo! I just did a vlog in less than 10 minutes and I stayed on topic and I put my flex in there so none of you can email me and said I didn't do it. Have a great Sunday. I'll be back tomorrow.